Typically, you wouldn't find a basketball, soccer ball, or any other type of athletic equipment inside of a chapel. But tonight's different. It's a Monday night, and that means Fellowship of Christian Athletes is meeting to discuss two of their passions, sports and faith. Meeting each Monday night at 9, FCA members gather to break down the impact of faith on their lives. With the recent COVID-19 pandemic, many of these athletes have looked to God and their faith to help them through these trying times. And being a senior, it was kind of frustrating because we were ready to be get back into it for the fall, but um, it's been um, it's kind of an inspiring way to um, uh, grow as just an athlete, but um, kind of reach out to the freshman um, players because they have a whole different situation. These last eight months, as everybody knows, has been crazy. Um, and, uh, but I think it's been a really good time uh, for me personally, just getting a break from the, the typical schedule um, of sports. You know, that's kind of dominated my life the last uh, really 18, 19, 20 years. Um, and so to be able to just kind of have a, a change in pace and change in, um, you know, just having that time to relax and um, really focus on other things that I haven't been able to really focus on um, too much before uh, has been a really nice change. After spending three years learning about Christ in sports, people like Maddie, Steven, and Jared are now a part of the leadership team at FCA. As a leader, I um, just try to like organize as a one uh, with the team. Uh, I have a like leadership team here with Steven and Maddie and also Kylie and a few other uh, athletes in Waynesburg. I, I don't, I just like sharing the gospel. Uh, I just like doing lecture for FC has a different topics for each year. And I kind of like, you know, give them, hey, like let's serve 100% and do let's like sacrifice and then let's bring it as a team. That's all I do. <laughs> I mean, uh, I do the learning first, you know, running a little bit of a social media as well. Ever since freshman year, we kind of rebuilt the leadership team um, for FCA. So we've been kind of there since the end of freshman year, so three years in the leadership team. FCA Waynesburg has created quite a unique bond around campus between the school's different teams and athletes. Uh, with so many of these athletes, freshmen, sophomores, juniors, so many of their seasons getting cut um, or you know shifted to the spring, um, it's a lot of uncertainty and I think it's important to be able to come together um, as we've been doing, uh, even if it's you know socially distanced, trying to do that to the best of our abilities. Um, and yeah, really just lean on each other uh, because you know we're all athletes. We're all missing out on uh, you know seasons, practices, games. Uh, we're all trying to do the best we can. Uh, but I think it's really important that we are able to come and do things, uh, play little games, or um, just kind of dive into the Word and see, um, you know, just kind of the power Christ has. And um, you know, as I said, He's He's had it planned out, and so just trying to find comfort in that and reassuring each other and kind of comforting each other along the way. Uh, kind of diversity that you don't get um, normally on campus because we're all kind of in our little pods from people we know at classes or people we, we are on teams with. So um, this is a great way for athletes to come together and um, dig into their faith a little bit more um, relating to the competitive side. Just the community that affects like we are the family. Uh, like just playing sports could be very competitive with each other. But outside of the field, we are definitely friends, uh, family, and then we are one of a big community. But inside of, on the field, we are definitely like friends and family, but still we want to like, hey, like, let's get better. Let's play better together as a family aspect. Uh, it, it could be even different team. We are, hey, good job. Like, you played really well uh, last week and la yesterday. There's just an like, encouragement, like, you can do it in a, like, outside of, you know, different outside of field and also different like, you know, sports that even football team can say, oh, yeah, you guys did an awesome job. That, that aspect, that family and then be a one team, even different team. It's something to um, all to come together for a focus. Um, instead of just competing against each other, I like to say um, being competitors for Christ. So um, finding ways to um, focus on him. Um, not just through our um, athletics, but um, kind of incorporating it in while we're like doing our work off the field. Whether it's in the gym or the chapel, Fellowship of Christian Athletes is always welcoming new members. For WCTV, I'm Dylan Cleland.